Hello YouTube, this is Keith Kevin Kent. How you doing? How you doing? I hope you're doing well. Time again for another knife of the day. This is Keith Kevin Kent. We've been doing a lot of knives of the day. One reason is I spent a lot of money on knives. <laughs> I'm recording this in March, uh, what, March 2019. And uh, boy, earlier this month, I did a trimming. That's when I sell off some of my knives to make room for them in the five Pelican cases. I always get the question, where do you carry, uh, where do you store your knives? I have four Pelican cases. They're 1550s. And then one 1600. You could take a look at it. And always, about three times a year, they start looking. They they start looking like they're going to overflow. And I put another 1550 in my Amazon basket, my Amazon Prime basket. Then I go, uh uh, and we do a trimming of the collection. I only sell knives to folks on this channel. So now's the time to subscribe and turn on your notifications. It's usually a first come first serve. So some of the newer knives, actually the last, <laughs> the last trimming, almost all of the newer knives I sold. Um, so let's talk about this. This is an interesting knife. I received three new knives from Spydeco. Um, I hope that you had a chance to take a look at the last video that I did. It's the uh, Dmitry Sinkovich collaboration with Spydeco. Check out that video. But these two more came with that. And this is a mass drop, a mass drop exclusive. Spydeco Delica 4, a mass drop exclusive Delica 4 with Super Gold 2 steel. Super Gold 2. You may hear it uh, referred to as SG2 steel, but it's Super Gold 2 steel. Yeah. This is the first time I've heard of this steel. I know a lot of you are like steel experts, or at least you're expert at Googling steels. <laughs> Just so all of you know, because a lot of times when we go into new steels, I get comments about how dumb I am about steel. As if I come on and go, hello, you two. <laughs> this is a, a physicist. <laughs> I'm a knife collector. By the way, just for all of you to know, when Spydeco releases a knife, especially um, an exclusive, there's a big white paper included that literally talks about every element in the steel and what percentages it has. Okay? So just like most people, I could read it off the list. But honestly, that's just not me. So... Um, and I don't like, this is just me. I respect people who love to go super detail. Whenever you're collecting anything, that's those folks. That's not me. Um, but I will tell you some of the properties of Super Gold 2, SG2. And I will also ask folks out there, you guys are so great, this community, when you actually explain in a couple of sentences what SG2 or any new steel that I talk about is. I respect you guys more than anything, so hopefully you'll add on to this and give us a even better explanation. But Super Gold 2 SG2 has great edge retention. Um, it's easy to sharpen too. And I know, 
a lot of folks, oh, and it is definitely a stainless steel. In fact, it is uh, a very, very good, um, it's very good with corrosion. So, but that retains an edge, easy to sharpen, a real good stainless steel usually leads to a very nice knife. Now this is a brand new Spydeco Delica 4 with this steel. As I told you, it's a mass drop. It's a massdrop.com exclusive. So you guys pretty much know what a Delica is, right? It's just under two point, uh, just under a three inch blade, 2.9 inches. It's full flat grind, so of course, it's a real nice slicer. It has a little bit of a choil here, so you can grip up on it. So the edge, the entire size of the uh, blade is 2.9 inches. The edge is 2.6 inches. The total length is 7.1 inches. When people ask me what size knife, I say smaller. But you want to know what? This is what I mean. <laughs> A smaller knife, great to carry, cuts forever, just really nice. Now, um, this is a real lightweight Delica with FRN scales, fiberglass, reinforced nylon scales. I call it space age plastic. That's what it feels like. And it is so durable. Then they have this bi-directional grip, which gives you good grip. Doesn't eat into your palm or anything. Just a real nice grip. Four-way clip. It's the regular clip. Four-way clip. Left, right, up, down. At some point, I'm hoping. This is, man, I talk about clips. You guys know I don't obsess over much. <laughs> but I love, I love my wire clip. And it just seems to me when you have a knife that only weighs 2.5 ounces, like this one, embedded steel liners, back lock, we'll talk a little bit about that back lock and four-way clip, it might be nice to start transitioning this to a wire clip. That seems like way too much clip with three <laughs> screws in it. That stability clip on a Delica. But man, it does feel nice in the hand. It's for everyone. Except it's a back lock. And I have heard from a lot of you guys, you just don't buy back locks. You know, they. I know uh, this is right out of the box. Not as smooth as it will get. I like a backlog. It, it feels so sturdy. In this case, they make the point that it's Super Gold 2, SG2, just as a highlight, especially with this black FRN. They have a gold coated backlog. See that? <laughs> They say it helps a little bit with corrosion and the friction of it, but that's Spydeco talk. But it really is just cool, isn't it? <laughs> I never had a lot of friction problems with a backlog from Spydeco, but I was stunned. I pulled it out. I'm going, oh, this is a nice new steel. Uh, I'm happy about it. I hadn't read that much about uh, SG2 steel. And then when I saw the highlight, I'm like, oh, man, this is pretty cool. The knife of the day, the brand new Spydeco Delica 4 with Super Gold 2 steel. Super Gold 2 steel. It's a MassDrop.com exclusive. And I now have it. Tomorrow we'll have another Super Gold 2 knife. Comparing the Delica 
with the natives and the Mannix too. Just to give you a feel for its size, but it's, this is the knife. I usually say, what do you like about knives? And someone recommend, they say, I, it'll be my first knife and I want it to be a spiteco. First I talk about the value folders and I give them the real deal of the value folders. You know, they're kind of heavy and the steel's not that great. But for the most part, 95%, I say get a Delica. And most of the Delicas, now there's a lot of variations on Delicas, but most of them are with FRN, so they're light as well. And then I say, if you want a bigger one, there's a lot of choices, but you know, the Endura is a good choice because that's a big version of the Delica. And usually they're not that expensive either. Good steel, lightweight knife, and a form factor that's a Spydeco classic. I'm loving this. I'm loving it. Hope you guys are having a perfect day. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on your notifications. Really appreciate all of you. Don't forget to check out the, um, the knife that I posted on Saturday. The Dmitry Sinkovich collaboration with Spydeco, the Drunken. That's on the video before this one. And check out my playlists as well. You guys have a perfect day. Keep those pockets full. Goodbye.